All right, um, so I'm going to take you through the process for uploading your scene to Seven Scenes. Uh, so the first thing you're going to do is obviously go to the website. So just remember it's web, web.sevenscenes.com, as opposed to www.sevenscenes.com. That'll take you to this interface. Uh, then you need to log in. So go up here and click on Login. And the username is capital... DCC underscore capital S and then Tori storytelling and the password is just our class ENGL 293 and go ahead and log in and once you're here uh, click on the dashboard and you'll be shown the scenes that we're directing uh, our class is working on rewriting UMD so click on that and it brings you to this interface. Uh, if we clicked here, we would go in and, and look and actually see the content, but we are going to edit and add content. So we go over here and click on edit. Uh, and so now we're in the edit screen. You don't need to worry about anything except for map. Uh, you're going to add your content to the map. Uh, remember that we have three different potential place labels, alternative history, lesser known history, unique location. Uh, so you'll go to places and from here you'll probably you want to zoom in a little bit to find the exact place that you're going to talk about. You're going to go up here and you're going to grab one of these tabs. Now the tab that you're going to use is the combination tab because we're going to have both text and video. So take it, drag it, and let's put it here uh, on McKeldin Mall. And so the first thing we can do is for the options, we're going to give it a, a label. We're going to call this a uh, lesser known history. And then content, we need to give it a name. It's about alt history of Mac something like that. Um, and it's just something that really kind of explains uh, what it is. Then you're going to go to slides. Uh, I'd like you to, while you're at the location, just snap a picture of it and then upload that image. Um, and so now again, this is just an image, not the video. So if we click here, go and we add this image. Um, Have that image and the description now remember so here is going to be your 400 to 500 word history and background of the location and make sure you refer to the assignment sheet uh, for the kind of specific things that i'll be looking for in this uh, history, alternate history, uh, lesser known history, and so forth. So that would be your text, the body of your text. Then you'll add a second slide, and this will be your video. Uh, so remember, you'll take your video with your with your phone at the location, and then you'll upload it to uh, Google Drive, and then share it with me. I'll download it, and I will compress it, and I'll be able to compress the file uh, quite a bit. So you can actually take as long as you want. I, you were talking earlier about three to five minutes being ideal, and I think that's right because I can compress things down to under 10 megabytes. It's not a problem. So three to five, three to five minutes is where you want to be. Uh, to add our media, we just click here. Go again to files. Um, you can't see this, but I'm just opening up files. Uh, I give it a name. This is my basement. This is just a video I made really quickly for demo demonstration purposes. The original video was 150 megabytes. I compressed it down to four, four megabytes, so you get an idea. Uh, short description. And, and you're done. Um, click Save, and now our tag is there. So the next thing you're, you're done for now, now what you want to do is 
check it out and make sure in the user interface where somebody would be reading it, it actually works. So click done, takes you back to this screen, click done again. And from here, you can go and click on it as if you were just a reader, not an editor, and we see our tab, I'm sorry, wrong thing, uh, there on Kelden Mall. So if I click on it, uh, you notice I, the picture I think really helps. Uh, then there would be the picture and the location information. Then if I click next, uh, we see the video, click on the video. All right, so uh, this is my basement. All right, so enough of that. Um, you get the idea. Uh, and you're all set. So uh, check to make sure, do take a minute to check to make sure that everything got loaded properly in this interface. And after that, you're done. All right, let me know if you have any questions and I look forward to seeing your edits and contributions.